guys, it's Maria. Today I'm going to do another what's in my bag, but today I'm going to be showing you what's in my work bag. So first I'll just give you a quick tour of my bag. Some of you guys have asked about this because I featured it in my tour of my capsule wardrobe video and have asked what it is and I'm going to tell you everything about this bag and then show you everything that's in it. Okay. So this is my work bag. I take it with me every single day to work and I really only use it during the work week. So basically just Monday to Friday and then it kind of just sits by the front door during the weekends because I don't really use it then. Um, so it is from Coach and I think it's called, I think it's just called Tote, but I'm going to link I'm going to link to it in the description so you can like actually check out the real name and all the details on it. Um, and I decided to get it because I wanted a, ooh, I wanted a bag that would be big enough to fit my work laptop and just something that would be sturdy enough that I could carry it five times a week forever and it not to get messed up. Um, previously I used a fossil bag and I liked it, but I am like super, super brand loyal to Coach. I love Coach. Um, and so then I just decided to get this one. So I got it in the brown leather. Um, I also kind of want to get it in the black, but I'm not going to do that because that would just be like excessive. But I do really love it. Um, it comes with, like when you get a coach bag, they will give you like a free monogram thing. So I did that. Um, and then I think one of my favorite things about this bag is it has this like little front pouch right here. So I'll just start with the stuff that's in the front pocket. And this is generally like my go-to stuff, like I need to grab it quickly. So the first thing I have in my purse is hand sanitizer from Walgreens. Um, this has been especially like helpful because like since it's so hot in the subway and like the subway is already kind of like grody, as soon as I get to work I like to put on some hand sanitizer just so I feel clean. Um, so the next thing I have is... Um, a NARS Audacious Lipstick. So this is the lipstick I usually wear to work. Um, but this is Raquel and I've had it for two years and this is all that's left. <laughs> I seriously love this lipstick so much. I think I'm gonna like start bringing my lip brush so I can like scoop it out. I just love it so much. But it's the perfect shade for me and I always keep it with me because I just wear it at work almost every single day. Um, I have a chapstick in here because I always need chapstick. Um, one of my friends gave me a sample size of Philosophy like hand cream. I actually haven't used this yet, but I just threw it um, in my... Oh, dang it. <laughs> um, I haven't used it yet, but it smells really good, and I just threw it in the front pocket of my bag because that's where I keep all that kind of stuff. Um, I also have this mirror, so this is, yeah, this is Mother of Pearl. So this is a Mother of Pearl compact mirror. Yeah, one of Sangmin's mom's friends just gave to me, um, and I love it. One side is magnified and the other side is regular. So at work, I always have to like check and make sure my lipstick looks okay, like, after lunch um, so I'll just like quickly check at my desk or I'll check if, to see if I have any like things stuck in my teeth like I used to just use the front view camera on my phone but the quality isn't as good um, and then I also have a um, a tea bag so I've been drinking a lot more tea and I guess I just put this in here it's Tazo vanilla caramel chai probably drink that tomorrow okay so that's everything in the front pocket. And this technically wasn't in the front pocket, but my phone is also always in the front pocket. And if you're wondering, I have the um, um, 6 Plus. So moving on to the main compartment, I'm just going to randomly grab. Um, this is an envelope with some random papers in it, but I use it as a fan. <laughs> Because sometimes it takes a while for the subway to come in the morning and you guys have no idea how freaking hot it is in the subway and like you're in your nice work clothes and I'll just like fan myself and my armpits and like I just hate being so sweaty and hot and I use this so much it's gotten like really crinkly um, and I'm thinking about getting like a cute folding like 
fan because some of the ladies carry those, but right now it's just a stupid envelope. Um, so my wallet, my wallet is also Coach. Sangbin bought me this shortly after we got married, and it's actually a pretty cool wallet. It comes with um, this gold chain, so you can use it as like um, you can use it like as a little tiny purse too, or a wallet. Um, so in the wallet, there's just like regular cards and stuff. You guys know I like to carry Polaroids of Sungbin and me. <laughs> just I just throw them everywhere, so I always have one. This one is um, us at brunch one time. Um, but anyways, I just like to have like little Polaroids with me at all times, I guess. So this is my work laptop, and I take it with me like every day. And then I keep this, and then I put this like purple folder next to it because I usually have like a lunch container and stuff in here and I don't want it to mess up my laptop, my work laptop, so I just um, put the folder there. I have just like a plain journal if I have to take notes. Like one time Songbin and I went to a lecture at Hunter College after work and I just wanted to take some notes. Um, I have a bunch of napkins and I just keep these because sometimes like when you're in the subway and you need to blot your sweat. Oh my god, this is such a gross video. But it's so true, you guys. You get so sweaty waiting for the stupid subway. And like, I don't want to be all gross and sticky. Um, so I just keep these napkins to, yeah. Here's the pen. Um, got some like bobby pins that I'm not going to pull out. Some medicine, just some Advil. Okay, so this is the main compartment. I actually really don't have that much stuff in here. There's a few side pockets. Um, and then there's a zipper pocket in here. And I have lots of stuff in here. Um, so, I have these like lint removing sheets. Because you guys know we have two cats. And I like to wear black. So I get their cat fur on me at all times. I'm usually pretty good at using a lint roller before I leave for work, but I just like to have some like um, lint removing sheets on me just in case. And then I also have a leather wipe. I used it. Um, I have a rosary. So when my cousin was ordained as a priest, he gave us all these rosaries, so I just keep this one in my purse for me. Um, I have a charger that looks really sad. It's pretty tired looking tired looking um, charger. Here's the care instructions for the bag. This is my sunglasses case with no sunglasses in it. And then here are my keys. So cute. It's um, a New York taxi because I'm a tourist. And then this little maroon puff ball that I got in Korea and now like everyone has one. But it's so cute. I love it. Um, and then I think the last thing is this, oh, this is so good. I got a diptych, um, perfume sample, and it's all used up, so I should actually probably throw this away now. Um, but it smells so good. It's, uh, Eau de Concatre. Ah, it smells awesome, but you guys, I can't afford their perfume. It's too expensive. Okay, and then I think the only other thing in, in here is just a bunch of crumbs. Okay, so that is what I keep in my work bag. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I would love to know what you keep in your work bag. What do you take with you every day when you go to work? Um, I'm curious if um, I'm curious if what you have is similar or if it's drastically different. Um, I always think it's kind of fun to watch these videos. I don't know why. I think it's just so interesting to see like what people carry around with them every day. Um, but anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. And excuse me for looking a little bit um, sloppy right now. It is the end of the day. Um, but it's fine. Um, also, this shirt you guys have probably never seen before. I'm planning on getting rid of it. It's um, it's kind of like on the... It's like I'm not going to get rid of this shirt until I get a new shirt. But I just have no desire to go shopping or buy anything. Which is like so unlike me. Because I always used to like 
be so anxious to go shopping and go in the stores and like buy new stuff and like I don't I don't know if it's because like the capsule wardrobe philosophy is like actually working on me or if I'm just so busy that I like don't really care about buying new clothes right now but I don't really like this shirt I don't like this color on me I think I look better in like blacks and browns and I just don't really like this navy blue and I'm not like crazy about this weird like keyhole thing um but I decided to wear it today because it was clean and it's almost like sleeveless and because it was so hot I thought it would be good um I don't know why I decided to tell you that oh I think just to let you know that I do keep like a mental list of clothes that I'm eventually going to get rid of <laughs> but like you know how I always tell you guys like it's a process with your capsule wardrobe like you can't get rid of you might not be able to get rid of everything all at once just because it would be too expensive to replace it so this is one of those items you know I don't love it it's not really my style it's not it doesn't really fit all my color schemes super well but I just don't have you know the resources to replace it right now so I'm just trying to make it work as best I can I'm pairing it with um if you guys can see I paired it with this skirt which I wear all the time it's like this really cool high-waisted white skirt I mean it's okay it's not the worst thing in the world but as soon as um, I find a good replacement, this guy's going to get out of here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate all the comments and likes and things that you leave. It's so fun to go through, and I try to respond to them as quickly as possible, even though sometimes it can be a few days. Um, but anyways, if you haven't subscribed already, you should. I post new videos every single Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. And um, be sure to follow me on Instagram and Pinterest to see how I style my capsule wardrobe in real life. And see um, if you follow me on Pinterest, I also include things that um, I'm thinking about adding to my capsule wardrobe or just things that are inspiring me. Um, I guess I think that's all the announcements that I have. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you tomorrow.